Hi, welcome to the good old Sega CD. We're gonna see a game I, what? A game I played when I was a kid. Uh, I was a big Jurassic Park fan and I had a Sega CD, so what the hell? I wanted to play Jurassic Park for the Sega CD. Um, Jurassic Park, uh, after of course the book and the hit movie had a ton of games out for it. And what's odd is a lot of them are very different, and the Sega CD plays like no other Jurassic Park game I've seen. Uh, specifically, yeah, it Voice the Dog has it. It actually plays a lot like Mist and the Seventh Guest kind of deal. Mist. Well, or, the puzzles aren't that hard. Tell me if the music. This music is actually really low to start with. turn that up a little for you. This does have FMV. Don't expect too much acting, though. But there is some. I do have a walkthrough here as well. And I've not used this emulator in some time. So not that we'll need save states. I'm lying. We will absolutely need save states. This game is not fun. Dark kids here. I made the mistake of buying a Sega CD. You and me both. Um... Options are just uh, controls, travel, which is go where, matrix, which is your inventory, which is really obtuse way of saying inventory and fire use, you get the idea. I haven't played this in years, so it's going to warn you all. I'm our mission. So this takes place after the movie, actually, but before Lost World. This is before Lost World is anything. The idea is that it's a good company, InGen. InGen tells, wait, oh, wait. All right, only 12 hours, right? Off camera, our helicopter crashed on the island of, what is it? Isla Nubla? God, I forget. It's been forever. Okay. So, we do have a 12 hour time limit. Um, and we get our first item, which is the stunner. This is the kind of game Jurassic Park is. You kind of look around for things like let's. Oh, I guess I have a rock. Yeah, a big rock. Okay. Um, yeah. So like I said, this game takes place after the movie, but this is before Lost World was like a thing. So yeah, InGen has sent. I think InGen's a good one. InGen has sent us uh, to uh, retrieve these dinosaur eggs, and we're gonna have to do that. So let's save state a bit, what the hell? And walk to the... How very Return to Zork. If you didn't know, by the way, the Sega CD can only do like 64 colors, although there was like a hack. Unfortunately, there's no like, look kind of button. Okay, so. Hmm. Alright, well, we can't learn about Brachiosaurus right now. I believe this takes us back to the helicopter. Oh, wait, 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 look at that. What's in here? We got a, a white key. Alright. Looks like there's egg spore around. Visitor center. All right, then let's head to the visitor center. I think that's a good place to start. Let me know if the music's okay. It's super low for me. I'll turn it up a bit, because... All right, it looks like there's something here. Or not. Uh, we can hit the left side. This is 
Tyrannosaurus, Stegosaurus, and uh, Kraken. Octopus. Go to the beach. Hopefully, Dennis Nedry hasn't. Is this Procompsignathus, maybe? Compies, as they're called? No, Gallimimus. Okay. Gallies are the fastest dinos on the island, up to 50 miles an hour, and one of the smartest. Gallies had front claws like grizzly bears, long and straight, great digging tools. Galleys could dig prey out of their burrows, and they could use their claws to dig very deep nests. Who are you? Galleys had a stiff torso, stiff tail, like a T-Rex. They couldn't maneuver in dense forests. <laughs> Galleys could attack you with the long reach of their forepaws, and they could kick you with their hind feet, too. Are we supposed to know who this is? I don't. There are some modern bird species that try to sneak their eggs into another mother's nest. If the mother detects these sneaky eggs, she can roll them out of her nest, and that could have happened with the dinos. Hey. Thanks. Uh, thanks. Anyway, uh, now what? Um, okay. I guess we could learn more, because there is a... Oh, Dilophosaurus. This is the spitting one from the movie, yeah. Mm -hmm. Just killed Dennis Nedry. The animal with the best poison delivery system is the spitting cobra. Could some dinosaurs spit? Could be. I mean, could be. The genetically engineered park where they have ones that spit. Fossil footprints show that Dilophs hunted in pairs. Top speed about 35 miles an hour. Dilophs had big crests on their head. Or maybe they had crests along the neck, too, like a lot of birds and lizards do. Canonically... Can be a warning. Birds and lizards flare their crests when they're about to attack. But canonically, you're supposed... You've seen these dinosaurs, you scientist. Dilophs had bodies built like compies. Long, flexible, great for swimming. All right, whatever. Listening to this guy use up the 12-hour clock. I, let's see. Well, we got, we got 11 hours, 40 minutes. Still plenty of time. Let's go to the visitor center, I guess. Um, I feel like I'm supposed to do something here. It looks like there's something, like, in this card slot. Oh, well, whatever. <laughs> I'm, I run very fast. All right, I don't know if you can see it through the grain, but that's, of course, the lobby. Welcome to Jurassic Park. Ooh. Yeah, I'll take pliers. Bling. Okay. This is not, um, Trespasser. Whoa, whoa. When someone asked if it's the one where you look down and see cleavage. Music's very upbeat and jazzy. So strangely, they dropped the scrolling part and went for, like, FMV camera turns. Very Return of Zork. I guess we'll try pliers, right? No? no. I guess that's no. Then we'll need a we'll need a um, crowbar. Interesting thing about a lot of the um, the video games, uh, you didn't actually shoot the dinosaurs with real guns. Even though in the book they took out the T Rex with a rocket launcher. Seriously. Um, no, in all the games though, they're all tranquilizer guns. This one's no different. I guess it was supposed to be, like, to keep the game, like, kind of PG-rated or whatever for kids, you know? What? Cannot, you could say, realistically, like, they wouldn't have given, like, someone like this, like, guns to kill these expensive creatures and all, but that's kind of 
I don't know, it's a little specious. Let's see if the white key works. That animation costs ten thousand dollars. Oh god, I love this technology already. Hello. Hi, I'm Emily Shimura. I'll be your contact on this mission, so keep an eye on your message light. It means I have new information for you. We were worried when our telemetry showed that your helicopter crashed. But as long as you're not hurt, keep going. We're pulling you out as soon as you've got at least one egg from each dinosaur species in the incubator. I'll check on you again in a couple of hours. Oh, and, uh, by the way, good luck. Thank you. Hi, I'm Emily Shimura. All right. Stop. Whoop. No. All right. I don't want to play this. Hi, oh, I'm she's going to think I'm creepy. I wonder if they're tracking the fact that I'm doing this. Okay. Hmm. I guess we should find the incubator, too. That's like another... <laughs> I dig these ultra-realistic uh, computerized sounds here. Reminds me, I should play the Tex Murphy games at some point. Whatever. I never played the Telltale Jurassic Park thing. I've heard of it, but I heard it, I heard it wasn't that good. But right. what? I I can't read that. Robert Muldoon, Game Warden. So Muldoon was is the guy who goes, clever girl, in the movie. He gets killed in both the book and the movie. The, they're pretty close, except that uh, in the book, Malcolm, Jeff Goldblum dies. But they bring him back in the book, in the sequel, Lost World, even in the book version. And they sort of, like, excuse me, they sort of, uh... What's the word? Like, plot spackle it away by, like, oh, there were reports that he died. And it's like, uh... It's your book, but all right. Yes, they should all be destroyed. That's the guy. Remember, Michael Crichton portrayed one of his critics as a murderous pedophile. Remember, too, Michael Crichton also had a video game he wrote called Amazon, uh, which I which I played here. We never finished. This is post Dino Apocalypse. Yes, by the way. Although, I don't see any signs where the T-Rex is here. And I think if I remember this game, we are actually safe. Whoops. <laughs> this music is ridiculous. Alright. Alright, well... Uh, let's try this way. I'm just gonna wing it for a little bit, and we'll use the walkthrough. This level two. These Gallimimus. Oh. Wait, hold on. Wait, wait, oh, can I get killed by these? No? Wait, wait, wait. I just want to... I'm sorry, I just want to see if I can die to those. Wait, oops. I don't think the two will kill me. 
but I really want to try because death in this game is really interesting and you're, you'll see. No? Alright, then we'll save the life, I suppose. Or, hmm. Tell you what. Tell you what. Here's what we'll do. We'll go back to save slot two. That way. Do this the right way. Oh dear. Okay. Yeah, whoa. Okay. Wait, did I get another rock? Yeah, yeah alright, there we go. Puzzle solved. Uh oh. Dilophosaur wait, let's let's die on purpose and see what happens, okay? Music is ridiculous. Did y'all hear that? <laughs> because if you didn't, I'm happy to do it again. It's, uh... They, like, sort of play these sound effects, which I think the Foley artist is, like, chewing celery or something, but... Oh, look at that! If you shoot it, then they run away. First. That's interesting. Take some egg. Notice, by the way, we do have limited ammo. Oh, we can't leave either. Uh, we can't use guns, yeah, for marketing reasons. All right, we're gonna die here, so let's try something new. We'll scare these things off like before. Take another rock, then we'll take the egg. Should've been paying attention in directions, but all right, let's say I'll try west this time. Oh wait, no, this is the wrong way. <sighs> Shit. All right, west to the visitor center, north. What's the matter with me? Oh, wait, look, there's one of them here, blocking the path. Uh-oh. Oh, dick. Oh, look, different eggs. I wonder if my gun's not good enough to get rid of Procom Signathus. What's this? Oh, a backpack. Alright, uh, I guess I'm gonna need something to cut this with, right? Yeah. Hmm. 
this thing? Oh, okay. We scared them away by knocking over a log. Get more eggs of theirs. What the? How long after Jurassic Park did this happen that one of the dinosaurs is completely decayed to a fossil? Whoa, hey, frog. <laughs> Hmm. I feel like the point is that the Gallimimus is supposed to steal What? What was the point of... Why did I do that? Right. I don't know even know where we're... Is this up a mountain or...? Well, what's hurting me? Something is hurting me. Oh, this stupid thing is kicking rocks at me. That... Wait, I want to die to this. I'm just curious. That's it? Whatever. Alright, you know what? We got, like, nowhere. So, I have a, I have a, I have a damn egg right now. There's another thing I wanted to do, too, which is, it looks like there's a card that's already in here. So let's use the pliers on that. We get a blue key. I wonder if the blue key will open any of the other doors upstairs. Okay, there we go. Jeez, I just friggin' fly everywhere. No. What does that even say? Time stops when you're moving. Oh my gosh, you're right, actually. Why are we turning this instead of... Return is works very hard, that's why. Oh, look, there's a message for me. So let's see what Emily has to say. Now they, like, very deliberately... You can hear, like, all the footsteps and stuff. I have to use this every time, really. Oops. Bad news. Bad news. We've picked up a blip moving toward the park. We don't know who it is, but it looks suspicious. San Jose Airport security caught someone trying to sneak out through the perimeter fence. Someone paid him $500 to tape a little box to the helicopter you flew to the park. It must have been an explosive. That's why you crashed. And now an unidentified aircraft is moving toward the island. This is serious. Don't waste any time. We have to get those eggs off the island as soon as possible. 
I'll call back as soon as we know more. Or send more people? Like... What? Like... <laughs> So wait a minute, at San Jose Airport, my helicopter is going to take off, and someone paid someone who worked at the airport 500 bucks to tape a black box to my helicopter, and they did it? The dick. I certainly hope that person got fired. 500 bucks. Newman. <laughs> Hello, Jerry. I would like to think that it was Seinfeld hired to do this stuff, but anyway. Oh, hello. Ah, wire cutters. That can help me later. Oh, wait, what's this? Right, Sarah? Okay. Tell me more. Triceratops was the most dangerous plant-eating animal that ever evolved. <laughs> ever? Ever evolved. Triceratops had very strong legs. It could accelerate in a charge right away and hit a top speed of 30 miles an hour. And it said it over there. It can weigh six tons. The Triceratops head was huge and heavy but perfectly balanced. It could whip its long horns in any direction. Triceratops had a strong bony frill that protected the neck. All around the frill were sharp edges. When it swung the frill, it was a deadly weapon. Is this guy like winking at me? Dinosaurs and birds have a lot in common. Since a lot of birds mate for life today, maybe the dinosaurs did too. Like birds today, some dinosaur parents might have been fiercely protective of their young. There are so many eggs in one nest, it looks like two or three or four females got together and laid in the same place. <laughs> Thank you. Huh? Uh oh. <laughs> oh no. Well, oh, okay. Hmm. Velociraptor. Yikes. Oh, man. Let's go this way first. This is a Sega CD game, yes. Triceratops, hey. Oh, hello. I'm up in the tree now. I guess I just could take a branch. Save. <laughs> All right, let's try the stunner on it. And all right, just in case anybody was not sure what happened, if you fire, I think if you fire at either of them, from what I remember, yeah. That's what went wrong. Okay, so let's. I guess let's ignore that for now and come back.
Wait, what? Oh, T-Rex, here we go, hold on. Wait, we gotta listen to this guy. <laughs> oh. I'm never gonna learn about Brachiosaurus or T-Rex at this rate. Oh. Every direction looks. God damn it! Every direction looks the friggin' same. Yeah, this is different, right? Hey, thanks for subscribing, Blue Sophie. Let me reload the thing in case in case your um, notification didn't come up. What the hell is this about? Oh. What? Oh. Try that again, I guess. Uh, I guess we should I should start looking at the walkthrough now at this point. Uh, blue key, tranquilizer gun. Okay. All right, so here's here's the issue. I've wasted about two hours on this. I'm just gonna walk by the Triceratops. Alright, so. How are we gonna do this? Uh, let me think here. Here's what we'll do. Let's go back a bit, right? Because apparently... Alright, we missed... I missed an item, so... Let's start doing this the right way, what do you say? Grab the pliers. Get the blue. Okay, so... Uh... Okay. Down the road visitor center. see here. Uh, use the blue key to enter the first room. Alright, we gotta get this. Alright, so we have to get to the second room. Which I didn't think you could do with the blue key, but apparently you can. Stella says you want to see something really stupid? Always.
Mm -hmm. What's the map? So I'm here. All right, so these are the seven types of dinosaur egg I need. Also a visitor center egg, I'm assuming. Okay, so Velociraptor, Compi, Triceratops, Galli. Gallimimus, I guess they were like the gazelle. Okay. But thank you. How do I get out of this map? Thank you. A lot of viewers today because Cry uh, apparently auto-hosted me. Thank you. I just started this stream now. What a jerk. There we go. Ah. All right, so what's the plan here? So the next plan is... Exit the visitor center. All right. Okay. Here's what we'll do. All right. Save state because we're going to now do some dangerous stuff. Save state before throwing the rock in the computer room. Okay. All right, Zealous, let's see what you got for us. Uh. Why did I turn around? What the? F Why did everything explode around you, but not in the actual room? I don't know. All right, time to get some dangerous stuff. Here we go. <clears throat> All right, here's what we're gonna do. Um. All right. Wrong way. No, no, no. Let's head back. We're gonna head south toward the Triceratops area. Uh oh, no, 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 I don't wanna be here. This is too frightening. Wire cutters. <laughs> Hello, T Rex. Alright, 
Um, let's see, continue traveling travel southeast. Uh, all right, honk the horn. So here's what we did wrong. We have to reach in, honk the horn, right? I guess the... Th right, so we'll, we got a... An injector, a blue key, and a triceratops CD. And we're dead. Hmm. So here's what we gotta do. No! Okay. What? Okay. Hmm. Alright, how do we do this exactly? So you honk this thing, right? Too soft. What? Alright, I think I see what's going on. Okay. Well, first of all, this is crap, so. Alright. I'm gonna leave it here, right? One. Two. No, I need this. Get this. Get the get the thing. Oh, I have it. All right, we're gonna heal your friend. Thanks, DP Static. Screwed up. I screwed that up actually in a way, but maybe we can be. Maybe we're still alright. So, what we'll do is we have to go back one because I forgot to pick up the branches. Apparently, I can feed the branches to the baby. Let's me search this box. I need a crowbar on that busted up thing? Oh, that gives me the Triceratops CD. Okay. All right. Now, with the Triceratops CD, I can go over here. Oh, and I got a new message. Oh, I got the Triceratops key.
Well, all the Triceratops are now kind of my friends. I'll probably not tempt fate with that horn. There we go. Whoa, what? Why would an electrical wire make that noise? Right. Anywho, according to the walkthrough, what I'm actually supposed to do... So, apparently, Jupiter Star, to make the, to make the Triceratops not hurt you, uh, you, you have to wait till it turns toward you to honk the horn and make it turn back, which... It doesn't make any sense as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> Wire ate you. Alright, so we'll feed the branches to the Triceratops. Again, look how busted this thing is. Why would I need a crowbar? Right, we'll take the Triceratops key. And we'll head. Apparently, we have to head back to the visitor center now. First, uh, the first arcade game I think was where the Brachiosaurus source attacks you with poop. Now enter all the rooms. And apparently we missed something in this room. Uh, this contains incubator and a first aid kit. There's our Brachiosaurus CD. Wait, what are these? Oh, that's that held up the tranquilizer gun. No point during this stream as Slobby said the magic word. Let's see if I can avoid it. I don't even know what that says. It's a poster of a Triceratops. I mean, I guess... A tiger? Why? 
<laughs> some park attendant. I wish we had tigers, though. So unhelpful. Whatever. Uh, there's the gas gun. Seriously. And night vision goggles. Hey. Okay. Uh, now that... <laughs> Let's make sure that Mike doesn't cut out this time, hopefully. Now that we've got the gas gun, we can leave. And now we can go after Dilo Dilophosaurus eggs. Where I do though, don't let me miss uh, one item down here. not play the journeyman product series right all right motion detector nice Again. All right. So allegedly, we got to go north. Oh, wait, what? There we are, shoot it away. Right, let's take our Dilo eggs, right? No, or whatever. All right, um, grab the eggs. All right, turn north, place. The, oh wait, we get another rock. Okay, so far, so good. So let's head this way now. All right, search the jeep in the west direction for the gas can. Apparently. Got it.
Got more eggs and a Tyrannosaurus CD. Nice, we can learn more. Now, with the gas, this is very obviously out of gas, this boat. So what do we have to do here? Uh, oh, travel across the river? I don't, I don't get it. Search your jeep in the west direction for the gas can. Uh, use the gas can on the boat. Travel across the river. I'm gonna die now. Gas can on the boat. Travel across the river and pick up the Dilo eggs. The eggs are to the left. I don't understand, though. get it. Hmm. I'll just get the hell out of here. Well, let's kill these. Maybe we should kill these things. It's three hits. Got it. Get up. Die, but still. Where are we? Head south. All right, and then. ignore it, I guess. We have to go south. There's a... Alright. Uh, 
take the eggs to CD. Grab that. And run, I guess. Uh... I do not like this video game. Yeah, no one does. Well, I like it. Sewer grid in the eastern direction. Return to the south. Grab the tree stump to the left of the caution sign. South to collect more eggs. Why? Okay. Yes. Um. <laughs> We can't travel east until we stun this frog. Now we can. Alright. Oh, there we go. I really need more of these stupid eggs. I mean... Bolt cutters, good. Right. Travel through the sewer. center and deposit our eggs. What's the point of that? Yeah, I think this is the kind of game you needed to walk through for. <laughs> Alright then. After that, we can go, uh, oh, we got new, we got new email, so let's listen to that. <laughs> What's, what, well, what? Huh? Oh, the eggs do die if you don't put them in the incubator. Uh-oh. I mean the egg's dead. Hey, thanks for subscribing, Wiz Probe.
Where's the incubator? There's another door here. What? Does this mean I can't? Let's go ahead to reload, save. Ugh. Hmm. Wonder if I should load, reload, save. Yeah, but I got, I thought I got two, I thought I got the Dilo egg and the, oh, actually, no, I didn't, because I never traveled across the river, so, I guess we could do it. Yeah, all right. It's southeast, southeast. Not get any triceratops eggs apparently. Um, out east. Oh yeah, look at that. I had pro compsignathus eggs, but apparently they died, it looks like. Alright, that's okay, we can get more. Um let's see here. Just open up the last one on the right and there. Turn off the power. Uh, 
What? Damn it. This game sucks. Oh, I had to kill these things again? the computer code from the third room of the visitor center. Fuck you! Just tell me what it is! On the theft, there's a computer that will play a special code. It's not copy protection. You just have to watch this stupid thing. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is seriously the worst game. Okay, here's what we'll do though, we're gonna cheat. Okay. Let's load SOT6 and we'll go back to the visitor center. Well, the guy. Oh, well, the guy did tell me actually. Yeah, let's just do this quick. So we'll read the code. Warp back. Safe state. This game is obnoxious. Tiger. Okay. Right. Hold on to your butts. Or everybody watch out for the code anyway. Rocky Dilo Gallic. Rocky Dilo Galley Compi. Alright, so Brachiosaurus is two headed. Dilo is a big robot. Golly and Compi. Rocky, Dilo, Golly, Compy. Rocky, Dilo. Mmm. <sighs> okay. You have to hit the Africa symbol too. Really?
Rocky, die low. I thought this was golly. Wait, I keep trying to say one more. This game sucks really bad. Um, <sighs> tell you what, I have a plan. Let's just keep going. Wait, what? No. North, west, west. Got it. Here's what we'll do. Now we're gonna travel east. The Brachiosaur area. Okay, so pre compy areas in the southwest. Look, eggs. Good. Oh, cool. All right. Um, and Brock here is to the north. Oh, hello. So let's insert the Brachiosaurus CD. Take it away, dinosaur guy. Brachiosaurs are really loud. They have an echo chamber built in their snout where their nostrils are, and when they blow noise through there, the sound is tremendous. Brachiosaurus was the biggest dinosaur, up to 40 tons in weight. That's as heavy as 10 elephants or five school buses, and Brax would go 100 feet long nose to tail. Brax, you know, we're on a first name basis. Intelligence low, aw. This is the slowest dinosaur in the park, 20 miles per hour tops, as fast as the average human. Now, Brax can rear up on their strong hind legs to reach high in the trees. Brax feet are really compact, so they can get bogged down in mud, it slows them down. Brax <laughs> have weak teeth. Blunt claws and a small tail, but <laughs> morphed into them under their huge feet. Brax chewed leaves with their stomach stones, and you could hear a constant rumble of digestion noises. <laughs> Baby crocs and gators have a special alarm call that makes the parents come running. Maybe Brachiosaurus had a similar system. All right, you hear that sound? It it played. <laughs> so the sound, what happens is this, the kiosk plays a sound. Yay, we get Brachiosaurus eggs. The Dino Wrangler. There we go. We did it. There you go. <laughs> okay. Next, we're going after T Rex eggs. What do you think of that?
I don't know why I'm saying that. Like, oh, we're so excited, slow beef. I mean, whatever. <sighs> I read up on how to get the code, says Zealous. Damn it! It's the most annoying system. There's no like compass in here now. I think I'm confusing people by titling the stream Dino Crisis, but having Jurassic Park is the. Thanks for that excitement bit. Yay, we have th we get we're three sevenths on the way out of here. Oh, insert the tri okay, got it. Bellis has the information. Not really a dino crisis, more like a dino inconvenience. That's a good point. So. There's nothing in this room but a big fucking dinosaur poster. So we have to, according to Zealous, we have to insert the Triceratops CD in here. Reveal code sequence. We want Triceratops eggs or let's go Tyrannosaur. According to the game fact, uh, play the Tyrannosaur CD for some great tips on how to defeat him. We have email to read too. And the tiger eggs. Evacuated workers claim that the bridge into the Dilophosaurus territory was never finished. The big storm washed several trees into the stream, creating natural bridges. Do what you can to steady the driftwood before you try and cross the river. Okay? I'm so busy, I can't even talk. To, I can't even look up from this clipboard. I'm sorry, I have to sign things here. By the way, Dr. Grant told me that the CD for the Brocky kiosk is somewhere in Wu's office under lock and key. At the end of the CD, there's a baby call. And every time they played it, the Brocks came galloping up. Solve that puzzle, and thanks for the Dr. Grant reference. Wink. Me again. Make sure you move <laughs> the eggs quickly to the incubator. The longer an egg is away from its nest, the colder it gets. If it gets too cold, the baby dinosaur can die. The incubator keeps the baby alive Look. until you're ready to leave. Got it? Look how naturally I received lunch in the middle of the email. <laughs> That's so incredible. When Dr. Sadler was on the island, she helped Dr. Harding, the veterinarian, with a sick triceratops. He worked out a treatment for the illness and carried injectors in his jeep. He's like, I had the Dr. back Harding doing. also told her not to haunt the jeep horn at the triceratops. Said, said it drives them nuts! 
I'm going to die here on this island full of dinosaurs. You could just take this a little more seriously. More bad news. We've got positive ID on that aircraft. It's a helicopter registered to Biosyn Corporation. <gasps> Those are the guys who hired Nedry to steal the dinosaur DNA from the island. Oh, no. And it looks like they're trying again. We're getting some interference. Hello, nice of you to join me. <laughs> I represent... Well, I guess it doesn't matter who I represent now, does it? Our people will arrive on the island in three hours. And we're after the same thing you are, so just stay in the visitor center. It should only take us about 30 minutes to complete our work. We don't want to hurt you. But if you get between us and those dinosaur eggs, well, I couldn't guarantee your safety. Just leave the eggs alone and stay out of our way. <laughs> oh shit, I remembered that, but I I mean I remembered that there is that guy but I forgot about that <laughs> damn you Biosyn <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's awesome. Let's go get some fucking T-Rex eggs now. Here's some great tips on how to beat the T-Rex, okay? <laughs> Tyrannosaurus rex had the strongest bite of any meat eater. Its forehead was four feet wide. T-Rex had a double-jointed jaw, could open its mouth so wide, it could swallow an entire Guernsey cow. T-Rex had armor-piercing teeth. It could crack a Triceratops neck in one bite. Whoa. Moderate intelligence. T-Rex could charge at 37 miles an hour, faster than the fastest rhinoceros. The eyes in T-Rex faced directly forward. It had great depth perception. Ears were good, too but it couldn't hear the high frequencies. Mm. T-Rex had a pecking spot right on the cheekbone where they'd try to bite or scratch in ritual combat. If you had a T-Rex you wanted to control, if you hit it real hard on the pecking spot, you might subdue it. How? With like a hammer? <laughs> ah! <laughs> <laughs> Tell me more, Dinos I like Dinosaur Jones is this guy's name. Alright. Everybody get ready. We're going after T-Rex now. Thirty seconds, huh? Uh oh. Seconds. Uh oh. Oh, hello. Try that again. Apparently, uh, 
I have to just shoot the T-Rex in the cheekbone. Opening sequence initiated. Door will open in 30 seconds. Yeah, Jurassic Park. Wait. There we go. Then you run between its legs and there. Uh... Sorry, mares. Was that supposed to be mates? Wait a minute. Um. Or north to hit the two small buttons. Well, this game has its moments, let's just admit it. <laughs> okay, I had to do this sequence again, sorry. Are you a woman? I don't think you're, like, specified at all, your character. It would be great if it were less bad. So I'm not safe from the T-Rex in here. Apparently. Where's the T-Rex even coming from in here? Oh, there's a big open thing here. Oh, hello. What the? I don't understand what this room is supposed to be. What is he doing? Why is there like a big fan going off while that dinosaur is eating me? All right, whatever. <coughs> He's showering. All right. Problem is, I'm supposed to use the left sewer. There we go. Uh, whoa, what? In the northeast, pick up the bear horn. Difficult to see. There it is. And then, uh, let's see here. Alright, uh, 
Turn to the s all right. Um, all right. Turn to the south. Pick up the T Rex eggs. Uh oh. What? Here's what we do. Pick up the bear horn. Pick up the T-Rex eggs. Okay, I get it. So what we had to do was... Oh, I have the bear horn. Okay, so... Go! Wait. I don't understand. Let's try that again. Why can't I open this first? Alright. Uh, I don't know what that T-Rex is doing. I'm not following here. What, like, what is making the T-Rex kick the thing? Is it that when I hit that button and it makes that sound, it's like, oh, I got to kick, whatever that is. That's it, yeah. There we go. Then we can climb through this pipe Whoa, jeez, okay. Back here! Uh. We're gonna travel north to exit. When dinosaurs ruled the earth. Jesus, get me the fuck out of here. All right. Let's go back and drop off the T-Rex eggs. more email thankfully I really love that email with that evil guy that was he was so good I hope we get more of him
Great. Awesome. Raptor eggs. We might not be able to finish the game, by the way. Because, uh, I don't know. Yeah, there's a limited amount of ammo, of course. So, it's totally possible we are not actually going to be able to finish this. I'd say lend me your power, but I mean, we've seen enough. I am i don't remember the ending being anything special, but I could be wrong. Oh, the bar on my upper right's my health. Shit, I should have used the <coughs> first aid kit. We're losing. We're losing it. We found another helicopter to pick you up, but Biosyn got to that one, too. There's nothing else that can reach you before they get there. You're stranded. Okay. We know that Biosyn's chopper will be landing in the next few hours. Collect as many of the eggs as you can before they show up. I'll try to arrange some sort of a backup transport. Hang in there. Thanks. Wait, is there another email already? Or, no, I never read bad news, so... I mean, I did, but... There. No wonder for a split. <laughs> Alright, how are we gonna do this? Uh... There we are. Yay. All right, so let's see here. Four, all right, so Velociraptor eggs are gonna be the hardest. But if we can get those, well, still not done actually. This guide also says to beat the Jurassic out of something, which is pretty bad. Anyway. Door opening FMVs don't have the same impact the Resident Evil ones do. This game, yeah, like Dino Crisis was such a better idea. Wait, 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 what? Wrong way. Hey, don't take our eggs. I'll say anything in the Ridley voice of the icon. Don't worry. <laughs> Is this game good? You bet your Jurassic it ain't. You bet your Jurassic isn't. Yeah, I like it. I b All right, here we go. All right. Travel south. She did. Wow. Should we learn a little about Velociraptors? The Velociraptor family has many species. Kickboxer. The one on the island is a giant called Utah Raptor. Utah Raptor was fast, up to 40 miles per hour, and a tremendous jumper. Utah Raptor was a kickboxing dinosaur <laughs> with razor sharp claws on the front paw and back I don't paw. think he was. <laughs> Raptors had huge brains, and they would work together in packs in hunting and for protecting their young. 
Utoraptor had large eyes, effective vision. Both eyes and ears faced forward so it could see and hear in stereo. <laughs> stereo! <laughs> Many smart predators today use burrows or caves to raise their young. Leopards do that, so do hyenas. Isn't everything Raptors with two ears? They are the smartest dinosaur predators. And if there were caves around, they'd take advantage of them for raising their young. <laughs> Raptors were so smart that if they were alive in a zoo today, they would learn to recognize tools and weapons. Uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> I mean, I'll, I'll give them opening the door, but maybe they recognize weapons. If you ever saw Jurassic Park 3, by the way, they go so far as to say that um, the raptors have, like, communication. <laughs> Make sure we get this rock. Yeah, here's what we do. Go two rocks. Uh-oh. Here we go. All right, immediately turn to the right, pick up the rock, travel up the stairs. I don't see a rock. I don't see the rock. Oh wow. Turn to the right, pick the rock, travel up the stairs. I heard I heard the little sound. Alright, uh Thanks, Timrod. Alright, um Search the long shaped rock in the west direction. filter oh wow I don't have enough rocks to do it <sighs> I need another damn rock all right Game sucks. Um, <laughs> I'm not even gonna pretend anymore. I can't believe, like, of all the things, I need more damn rocks. I never saw Jurassic World. Is that any good? I like to think the protagonist is running really fast to other areas. I do too. <sighs> Sorry, I keep losing direction. Okay. <coughs> this uh, um, world had the fake dinosaur, right? Indominus Rex, the invisible one, or something.
was like, wait, what was the code? Oh, wait, did I get it right the first time, actually? One, two... Yeah, actually, that, yeah, I made the right sound. The door I want, I want... This door. How was this? <laughs> we didn't want to get anything in that... Oh, there's the other rock I need. All right. <coughs> um, what's the trick to this one? Well, I might have already missed my... Okay, here we go. I gotta wait for the Gollum, the Galley Mimis to steal. I should, uh, wait, what? go for it let's just go for it not even worry about it we're running out of time these triceratops eggs die well that'll suck do it all right so first things first gotta grab the rock run upstairs was but whatever how big are these rocks now all right so what do we do for this then Immediately turn toward the north gate. The north gate. I get it. Can 
then I gotta turn off into the north gate. Hmm. All right. Oh, after you have the raptor key, travel southwest. Got it. Southwest. Yeah. Three caves. Uh, tranquilize the two raptors in the southern direction. Here we go. Um, turn toward the north. Let's just try it. North gate. Right? This is where I was, so it's not gonna work. That was another like two, three. Okay. Apparently, if you keep them on screen, it's kind of cute. Uh. There we go. Uh, travel east past the first raptor. Then quickly turn southeast. Like the raptor eggs. Okay, now I got the raptor eggs, right? So... Turn to the east. Use the crap. Wait, east. And use the. Oh, there it is. Use the crowbar on the manhole cover. Wait, wait. There we go. Jump in there. Uh, northeast, west, and you're at the front gate. Okay. <sighs> We did it. Kind of. Guava moment says you're so. Hey, Guava moment. Guava moment is correct. We're out of time. It's a shame because I have six out of seven of the eggs. But 
What are you gonna do, I guess? Oh, I'm out of time. What happens? What happened? Couldn't you stop them? What? Biosyn doesn't care how dangerous these dinosaurs are. They'll have them all over the planet in months. We may be next on the endangered species list. Well, it's not my fault. Damn it. Hmm. All right, Jurassic Park cheats. Collect an egg, then find the toolbox. Uh. Right. Damn. Well, I think we failed Jurassic Park. Let me see here. Right, let me find a safe state where I'm near the computer. You know, close enough. Because apparently there's a, a level select, so let's use that. Oh, did I? Oh, I do have the bullhorn. Bear horn. Whoops, no, no, no. One minute. Find the, there it is. Okay. Yeah, I have the blue one, good. Uh, let's see here. Second door on the right, all right. So, we're gonna cheat, because fuck this game. So here we go. Okay. Uh, use blue car, second door on the right, second floor, plus the. Do I have an egg, egg in the incubator, though? Why do I need one egg? I wouldn't have it. I only have the blue key card. Motherfucking game! <clears throat> Wait, that can't be right. Alright. I have an egg, so if we take the egg back to the visitor center, then we can skip. We can skip levels. Okay. God damn it! And nothing, none of the directions make any goddamn sense wherever you go. Yeah, I mean, if Biosyn's gonna get the eggs out of here anyway, I don't really even see the point, but whatever. Well, at least we got to see the evil guy. Yeah, we met the we met the root of all evil. We got rid of, we got past the T-Rex and the Velociraptors. <clears throat> so we'll go to Jurassic Park Visitor Center. We got to meet the dinosaur expert. All good stuff today on Jurassic Park. So here's what we do. All right, so, and the second door on the right. This is like the most obtuse, like, cheat code. Yep. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm well. I'm glad you're not disappointed, voice of dog. I knew that I they, I thought we'd have trouble finishing this because I I remember like as a kid getting screwed over by like the whole like ammo and time system. There's like a lot of unwinnable scenarios here, but here. We'll use the Triceratops key, which I can't believe is a thing. Load some eggs. All right, so we got the eggs, right? Now enter the control room. All right, this this cheat was uh, contributed by Pool of Jello, so blame Pool of Jello if it will do. You have the eggs, I can't tell. I put the eggs in. All right, access the computer and save the game. It sounds wrong. Maybe this is, is just all bullshit. Save the game. All right, leave the control room, then hold start on controller two. This is so stupid. There's a, there's a Goosebumps game with Jeff Goldblum. Alright, controller to define from left, right, A, B, C, start, zoom, load, okay. There we go. Hold start on controller two. Yay. What? Bin one. Yeah, look at this. We have to shoot our way out of Jurassic Park. Game is kind of bullshit. Two guys? Biosyn only sent two guys? So to the record, there is no final sequence with the dinosaurs or anything. You, I literally did show you everything except for the Dilophosaurus eggs. But, huh? What? Oh, was there one more? All right, I must have missed one more. <sighs> I did die, yeah. All What? What the hell is that? Well, how do I ever can do this? Right. I can't believe that the fight a fucking T-Rex and everything and the final boss of the game is a freaking guy in a lake. All right, that guy hurts me more, so let's kill him first. Uh, hit the bad guys in the head, according to the game fact.
What is he like, a mermaid? Why is his leg? Why are his legs doing that? Come on! This is fucking garbage. The gas gun's what I used to take out the fucking T-Rex. How do you... Alright. Safe scum like crazy, you're right. Whoa, alright, I think we killed him. Come on, there's a fourth guy? I am genuinely not sure. I actually did finish this game when I was younger. I just don't know how. By the way, no, this game was not compatible with the Justifier. Oops. Uh-oh. I hope that's good enough, because... You mother... Come on! How do I kill those fucking two shots? Close enough. I lost that? move. Thank God. Woo! There. What, what happened? What? When you stop them? Huh? Biosyn doesn't care how dangerous these what? I... are. They'll have them all over the planet in months. We may be next on the endangered species list. Well, wait, 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 wait. What? <laughs> but what 
what's the point of this level select if... <laughs> Fuck you, this. You had no eggs. Well... I'm counting it as a moral victory. I agree. The hell with it. 